Today we are covering the 11th Mitzvah Saseh from the positive commandments that we are still able to do nowadays. Mitzvah Saseh Likros Kriyas Shema Shachras Va'arvis. It is a positive commandment to read Kriyas Shema in the morning and in the evening. Shanamar, as it says in Devarim Parakavav, Pasuk Zion, Vidibar Tabam, and you should speak of them. When you lie down and when you get up. It's not actually as you're standing up and as you're lying down. It's in the time of lying down and in the time of getting up. Vihim shalosh parshios, and this is three parshios. Shema, the parsha of Shema. Vahayim shema vayomer, and the parsha of Vahayim shema and vayomer. Mipnei sheish beforashos shema yichod Hashem vavoso yisparach shema. Because there is in the Parsha of Shema the unity of Hashem and the obligation to love Him, this Visama Torah and the obligation to learn Torah, Shehu Yosid Shakol Tolebo, which is a peg that the whole world stands on. The Parsha of Hayam Shema and the Parsha of Hayam Shema, Yeshba Kabbalas Ol Sharn Hamitzvos. There is in it the acceptance of all of the other mitzvos. Lefarshas Vayomer, and in the parsha of Vayomer, Shehi Parshas Tzitzis, which is the parsha which speaks about the obligation of Tzitzis, Yeshba Zechiras Kola Mitzvos. It has in it the mentioning of all of the mitzvos, as we explained in the previous halacha, that Tzitzis represents all of the mitzvos that are in the Torah. Mitzvah Lahaskir Yitzias Mitzrayim, and it is a mitzvah to remember Yitzias Mitzrayim. We also have this in the third part of Shema. Shinemar, as it says in Devarim Perak Tes Zion Pasuk Gimel, Maman Tiskor Es Yom Seischot Me Eretz Mitzrayim Kol Yemei Chayecha. In order so that you should remember the day that you went out of the land of Mitzrayim, you should remember this all the days of your life. Nohig, and this is Nohig. The Chol Malkum of Cholzman at any place and at any time, meaning whether the base of English is standing or whether the base of English is not standing, is a Charim below the Nikavos, with male but not with female. So we learned in the Salacha that there's an obligation to recite Shema twice in the time of Shachris and in the time of Arvis, and that in the first parsha of Shema, we have Kabbalah Sol Malchus Shemaim, and the second we have Kabbalah Sol Mitzvos, and in the third we have the mentioning of Yitzias Mitzrayim and the mentioning of all the other Mitzvos.